You know, let's talk about the, the draw itself. <laughs> Luis Suarez is back in the mix. <laughs> How old were you when that incident happened? First of all, do you remember it? Because for some of us journalists, a lot of us, I remember I did not eat for two days. I just wasn't hungry. Like, <laughs> I just wasn't hungry. <laughs> do you remember the incident? You remember where you watched again? You're probably in the academy, no? Um, yeah, 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 I think I was in the academy. Uh, I think I was in Goma Fete. Wait, uh, that was um, 2010. 2010 years. I was, I was, I was in the academy because I got, I got drafted to the academy um, in the year 2010 also. So I was there. I mean, that was my first year in the academy. So I watched it there. I mean, it was uh, that was that was like a real nightmare for every Ghanaian. Um, hope, I mean, seeing Ghana going to the quarterfinals and then seeing seeing that yeah. we were really to get into the semifinals where. This incident had to happen, you know. So, yeah. But I mean, now when when the draw came up, me being here in France, you know, I have a teammate who plays in South Korea. So, and I have I have um, um, coaches who are from Portugal here. So the the conversation there with with them was just Portugal and South, uh, South Korea. I wasn't really thinking about Uruguay, but then I got messages on Instagram saying that um, look, even if you Uruguay, you don't you don't win that. And then. And then and then I started thinking, okay, this is real now. Ghanaians are really, really happy, and then we, they are really up for the revenge. So yeah. I think uh, it will be a good group, and yeah. then we see what will happen. I mean, in a few months to come.